The Common Sense Investor, Your Guide to Low-Cost Wealth Written by Ronnie Rowland Published by Growth Literacy Lounge Introduction The world of investing can seem overwhelmingly complex, with its vast array of options, intricate jargon, and constantly shifting market dynamics. It's easy to feel lost and uncertain about where to begin or how to navigate this financial landscape. But what if the path to financial success didn't have to be so complicated? What if simplicity, patience, and discipline could lead you to long-term wealth? Welcome to the Common Sense Investor Your Guide to Low-Cost Wealth. This book is your roadmap to demystifying the complexities of investing and unlocking the power of straightforward, low-cost strategies. Our journey together will focus on the principles of common sense investing principles that have stood the test of time and are accessible to everyone, regardless of their financial expertise. Throughout this book we will explore the fundamentals of common sense investing, from understanding the benefits of index funds to building a balanced portfolio that aligns with your financial goals. We'll delve into the importance of patience and discipline, the hidden costs of high fees, and the transformative power of compounding. We'll also discuss managing investment emotions, setting realistic expectations, and staying informed in an ever-changing market. Let's embark on this journey together, starting with a simple question, what is common sense investing, and why should you embrace it? The answers will transform your approach to investing and set you on the path to achieving your financial dreams. Join our vibrant community of seekers and learners by subscribing to the channel. Every subscription is a token of encouragement that fuels our ability to bring you more captivating and thought-provoking content. Subscribe, comment, and like. Become part of the movement shaping the future of learning and growth. In the comments, please let us know what type of books you would like to read. Your feedback helps us tailor our content to serve you better. Let's begin. Chapter 1. What is Common Sense Investing? Have you ever felt overwhelmed by the complexity of the stock market? With endless financial jargon and countless investment options, it's easy to feel lost. But what if the path to financial success didn't have to be so complicated? Enter Common Sense Investing. Common Sense Investing is about embracing simplicity and focusing on strategies that have stood the test of time. It's about cutting through the noise and zeroing in on what truly matters making intelligent, low-cost investments that grow steadily over the long term. Unlike the high-stakes world of day trading or the risky bets of speculative investments, common sense investing relies on proven principles anyone can follow. Imagine investing without constant monitoring or complex analysis. That's the beauty of common sense investing. It's accessible to everyone, regardless of financial expertise. Its core involves three main principles simplicity, low costs, and long-term focus. Simplicity complexity often leads to confusion and mistakes when investing. Common sense investing strips away unnecessary complexity. It focuses on straightforward investment strategies instead of chasing the latest hot stock or trying to time the market. For instance, investing in broad market index funds, which we'll delve into in the next chapter, is a prime example of keeping it simple. These funds track the overall market, providing diversification and reducing risk without needing constant adjustments. Low costs. High fees can erode your investment returns significantly over time. Common sense investing emphasizes minimizing costs wherever possible. This means choosing low cost index or exchange traded funds ETFs over high fee mutual funds. Keeping costs low ensures that more of your money remains invested and working for you. We'll explore the impact of fees in greater detail and show you how to identify and avoid costly investments. Long term focus. The stock market can be pretty unpredictable in the short term, but throughout history, it has consistently shown an upward trend in the long term. Sensible investing takes into account this long-term perspective. It's not about seeking quick riches instead. It's about steadily and securely building wealth. This approach demands patience and discipline, qualities we will develop together as we navigate this book. By maintaining a focus on the long term, you can weather market fluctuations and take advantage of the compounding power. Common sense investing is not a get-rich-quick scheme but a reliable path to financial security. It's about making informed, rational decisions and avoiding the pitfalls of emotional investing. Understanding and applying these principles can build a solid foundation for your financial future. Now that we've laid the foundation of common sense investing, let's explore how to get started with index funds, 
one of the most powerful tools available to investors. These simple, cost-effective investments can transform your financial future. Chapter 2. Why Index Funds? Why should you consider index funds for your investment portfolio? Investing offers countless options, but few are as straightforward and effective as index funds. Let's dive into why these funds are a cornerstone of common sense investing and how they can help you achieve your financial goals. What are index funds? Index funds are a type of mutual fund or exchange-traded fund ETF designed to replicate the performance of a specific market index, such as the SP500 or the Dow Jones Industrial Average. Instead of trying to outperform the market through active management, index funds aim to match the market's performance by holding a diversified portfolio of the same stocks that make up the index. This approach eliminates frequent stock buying and selling, resulting in lower costs and more stable returns. The Benefits of Index Funds One of the primary advantages of index funds is their low cost. Since they mirror an index, they don't require expensive fund managers or extensive research teams. This translates to lower management fees and expense ratios than actively managed funds. Over time, these savings can significantly boost your overall returns. For example, investing in a fund with a 0.1% expense ratio instead of a 1% ratio will save substantial fees over the long term. Diversification is crucial in reducing risk and achieving stable returns. Index funds offer instant diversification because they hold all the stocks in the index they track. By spreading your investment across a wide range of companies and industries, you mitigate the impact of any single stock's poor performance on your overall portfolio. This built-in diversification makes index funds a safer and more balanced investment choice. Consistent Performance While no investment is without risk, index funds have a track record of consistent performance. They don't aim to beat the market but rather to match it. Historically, broad market indexes like the SP500 have delivered reliable returns, averaging around 7-10% to annually over the long term. This consistency makes index funds an attractive option for investors looking to build wealth steadily and securely. Simplicity Index funds simplify the investment process. You don't need to spend hours researching individual stocks or predicting market trends. Investing in an index fund exposes you to the overall market's performance with minimal effort. This simplicity allows you to focus on other aspects of your financial plan and reduces the stress associated with active trading. Getting started with index funds Investing in index funds is straightforward. You can purchase them through most brokerage accounts, either as mutual funds or ETFs. When choosing an index fund, consider the following factors. Expense Ratio Look for funds with low expense ratios to maximize your returns. Tracking error. Ensure the fund closely follows the performance of its benchmark index. Reputation. Choose funds from reputable providers with a history of reliable performance. Building a foundation. Index funds are an excellent foundation for any investment portfolio. They offer a blend of low costs, diversification, consistent performance, and simplicity that aligns perfectly with common-sense investing principles. By incorporating index funds into your strategy, you can set yourself on a path to achieving your long-term financial goals. With the benefits of index funds clear, let's explore how to build a balanced portfolio that aligns with your financial goals. Creating a diversified and well-balanced portfolio is critical to maximizing returns and minimizing risks. Chapter 3 Building a Balanced Portfolio How do you create a balanced portfolio that stands the test of time? Building a balanced portfolio is essential for managing risk and ensuring steady growth. A well-constructed portfolio spreads your investments across various asset classes, reducing the impact of any single investment's poor performance. Let's explore building a portfolio that aligns with your financial goals and risk tolerance. Understanding Asset Allocation Asset allocation divides your investments into asset categories stocks, bonds, and cash. Each asset class has its own risk and return characteristics, and a balanced portfolio will include a mix that reflects your investment objectives and risk tolerance. Stocks represent ownership in a company and offer the potential for high returns, but they also come with higher risk. They are typically categorized into different types, such as large-cap, mid-cap, small-cap, and international stocks. 
diversifying within the stock category can help reduce risk further. Bonds are loans you give to corporations or governments in exchange for periodic interest payments and the return of the bond's face value at maturity. Bonds are generally less volatile than stocks and can provide steady income, making them a good choice for risk-averse investors or those nearing retirement. Cash equivalents include money market funds, certificates of deposit CDs, and treasury bills. These are low-risk, low-return investments that provide liquidity and stability. They are essential for covering short-term expenses and emergencies. The importance of diversification. Diversification involves spreading your investments within and across asset classes to reduce risk. A diversified portfolio is less likely to experience significant losses because different assets often perform differently under various market conditions. For example, bond prices may rise when stock prices fall, balancing your overall portfolio performance. Assess your risk tolerance. Your risk tolerance is your ability and willingness to endure market fluctuations. It's influenced by factors such as your financial goals, investment horizon, and personal comfort with risk. Understanding your risk tolerance will help you determine your portfolio's right mix of stocks, bonds, and cash. Determine your asset allocation. Decide how much of your portfolio to allocate to each asset class based on your risk tolerance. A common rule of thumb is the 100 minus age rule, which suggests that your stock allocation should be 100 minus your age. For example, if you're 30 years old, you might allocate 70% to stocks and 30% to bonds and cash. Adjust this allocation based on your specific financial goals and risk tolerance. Select your investments. Within each asset class, choose investments that align with your strategy. For stocks, consider a mix of index funds and ETFs that cover different market segments. For bonds, look for funds that offer a balance of corporate and government bonds with varying maturities. For cash equivalents, consider high-yield savings accounts or short-term treasury bills. Rebalancing your portfolio. Over time, the performance of different assets will cause your portfolio to drift from its original allocation. Rebalancing involves periodically adjusting your investments to maintain your desired asset allocation. This can be done by selling overforming assets and buying underperforming ones. Regular rebalancing helps manage risk and ensures your portfolio stays aligned with your financial goals. Staying the course. Building a balanced portfolio is not a one time task. It requires ongoing monitoring and adjustments. However, by sticking to your asset allocation plan and avoiding emotional reactions to market fluctuations, you can maintain a balanced and diversified portfolio that supports your long-term financial objectives. Now that your portfolio is balanced, it's crucial to understand the role of fees and how they can impact your returns. In the next chapter, we'll uncover the hidden costs associated with high-fee investments and show you how to avoid them ensuring more of your money remains invested and working for you. Chapter 4. The Hidden Costs of High Fees Did you know high fees can significantly affect your investment returns over time? Many investors overlook the impact of fees, but understanding and managing these costs is crucial for maximizing your wealth. In this chapter, we'll uncover the hidden costs of high fee investments and show you how to avoid them. The Impact of Fees on Your Returns even seemingly small fees can profoundly impact your investment returns due to the power of compounding. For example, consider two investors who each invest $10,000 in a fund that returns 7% annually. Investor A chooses a fund with a 0.1% expense ratio, while investor B opts for a fund with a 1% expense ratio. Over 30 years, the difference in their final balances can be staggering. Investor A's fund grows to approximately $74,000, while Investor B's only grows to about $57,000. The seemingly minor difference in fees results in a $17,000 difference in returns. This example highlights why minimizing fees is essential for maximizing your long-term wealth. Expense Ratios The expense ratio is the annual fee that all mutual funds or ETFs charge their shareholders. It represents the fund's total operating expenses divided by the average value of the fund's assets. Lower expense ratios mean more money is invested and compounded over time. Load fees are sales charges or commissions paid to brokers or financial advisors who sell mutual funds. Front-end loads are charged when you buy shares, while back-end loads are charged when you sell them. No-load funds do not charge these fees, making them a more cost-effective option.
Transaction fees are costs incurred when buying or selling investments. These can include brokerage commissions, trading fees, and other charges. Choosing a brokerage with low or no transaction fees can help reduce these costs. Account maintenance fees. Some brokerage accounts charge annual or monthly maintenance fees. These fees can add up over time, so choosing a brokerage that offers low or no maintenance fees is essential. For avoiding high fees. Choose low-cost index funds and ETFs. Index funds and ETFs typically have lower expense ratios than actively managed funds. You can keep more money invested and work for yourself by choosing low-cost options. Look for funds with expense ratios below 0.2%. Opt for no-load funds. No-load funds do not charge front-end or back-end load fees, making them a more economical choice. Ensure the funds you invest in are no-load to avoid unnecessary charges. Select a low-cost brokerage. Different brokerages have varying fee structures. Look for a brokerage that offers low or no account maintenance fees and competitive transaction fees. Many online brokerages now offer commission-free trading, making it easier to minimize costs. Monitor your investments. Review your investments and the fees associated with them regularly. If fees are eating into your returns, consider switching to lower cost options. Staying vigilant about fees can help you make more informed investment decisions. The long-term benefits of low fees. Minimizing fees boosts returns and enhances the power of compounding. Over the long term, the savings from lower fees can add up significantly, allowing your investments to grow faster and more efficiently. By prioritizing low-cost investments, you ensure that more of your money is working for you. Understanding and managing investment fees is a critical component of common-sense investing. By choosing low-cost funds, avoiding unnecessary charges, and regularly monitoring your investments, you can maximize your returns and achieve your financial goals more effectively. Armed with knowledge about fees, it's time to delve into the power of compounding and how it can work in your favor. In the next chapter, we'll explore the magic of compounding and why it's a critical component of building long-term wealth. Chapter 5. The Power of Compounding have you ever heard the saying, money makes money? That's the essence of compounding, one of the most powerful concepts in investing. Compounding is the process where the returns on your investments generate their returns, leading to exponential growth over time. Let's explore how compounding works and why it's critical to building long-term wealth. Understanding Compounding Compounding occurs when your investment earnings, such as interest, dividends, or capital gains, are reinvested to generate additional profits. Essentially, you earn returns on your original investment and the accumulated returns from previous periods. Over time, this snowball effect can significantly boost the value of your assets. For example, let's say you invest $1,000 at an annual return of 7%. In the first year, you'll earn $70, totaling $1,070. In the second year, you'll earn 7% on $1,070 dollars which is $74.90, your total to $1,144.90. This process continues, with your earnings generating more earnings each year. The Rule of 72 The Rule of 72 is a simple formula for estimating the time it will take for your investment to double, given a fixed annual rate of return. You divide 72 by the annual return rate. For example, with a yearly return of 7%, your investment would take about 10.3 years to double 72710.3. This rule highlights the exponential nature of compounding. Starting early matters. One of the most critical aspects of compounding is time. The earlier you start investing, the more time your money has to grow. Consider two investors, Alice and Bob. Alice starts investing $5,000 annually at age 25, while Bob starts the same at age 35. Both earn an annual return of 7%. When Alice reaches 65, her investments will have grown to approximately $1,142,000. Starting 10 years later, Bob's investments will grow to about $556,000. Despite both investing the same amount annually, Alice's early start gives her nearly double the retirement savings, illustrating the importance of starting early to maximize compounding benefits. Patience and Consistency you are compounding rewards for those who are patient and consistent. Regular contributions to your investment portfolio, even negligible, can accumulate significantly over time. 
the key is to stay invested and avoid the temptation to withdraw your earnings prematurely. Market fluctuations are inevitable, but maintaining a long-term perspective benefits you from the compounding effect. Reinvesting Dividends Reinvesting dividends is a powerful way to enhance the compounding effect. Many companies pay dividends, and portions of their profits are distributed to shareholders. You buy more shares by reinvesting these dividends instead of taking them as cash, which can generate additional dividends and capital gains. This cycle accelerates the growth of your investment. The Impact of Fees on Compounding As discussed in the previous chapter, fees can significantly impact your returns. High fees reduce the amount of money available for compounding, diminishing your overall investment growth. Choosing low-cost investments ensures that more returns are reinvested and compounded over time. Maximizing compounding in your portfolio Start early. The sooner you invest, the more time your money has to compound. Stay invested and avoid frequent trading and market timing. Consistency and patience are key. Reinvest earnings, reinvest dividends, and other earnings to maximize growth. Minimize fees. Choose low-cost investments to ensure more of your money works for you. Make regular contributions, even small. Regular contributions can grow significantly over time. Compounding is a fundamental principle of wealth building. Understanding and leveraging its power allows you to turn modest investments into substantial wealth over time. The key is to start early, stay invested, reinvest your earnings, and minimize fees. With a grasp on the power of compounding, let's discuss the importance of patience and discipline in investing. These virtues are essential for staying the course and reaping the full benefits of your investment strategy. In the next chapter, we'll explore how to cultivate patience and discipline to achieve your long term financial goals. Chapter 6 Patience and Discipline Why are patience and discipline essential for successful investing? These virtues can set you apart in a world driven by instant gratification. Investing is not about quick wins but about building wealth steadily over time. Let's explore how cultivating patience and discipline can help you stay the course and achieve your long-term financial goals. The Value of Patience Patience in investing means having the foresight to stay invested, despite market fluctuations. The stock market is inherently volatile, with prices rising and falling unpredictably in the short term. However, over the long term, the market has historically trended upward. By maintaining a long-term perspective, you can weather the storms of market volatility and benefit from the overall growth. Consider the story of the tortoise and the hare. With its fast and erratic approach, the hare loses the race to the steady and patient tortoise. Similarly, those who remain patient and avoid reacting impulsively to market swings are often rewarded with investing. The Role of Discipline Discipline involves sticking to your investment plan, even when it's tempting to deviate. This means Avoiding market timing Predicting market movements is notoriously difficult and often leads to poor investment decisions. Instead, Focus on your long-term strategy and avoid the urge to buy or sell based on short-term market news. Regular Contributions Consistently adding to your investments, regardless of market conditions, can significantly enhance your portfolio's growth. This approach, known as dollar-cost averaging, spreads out your investment purchases over time, reducing the impact of market volatility. Rebalancing Your Portfolio Periodically review and adjust your portfolio to maintain your desired asset allocation. This may involve selling some assets that have performed well and buying those that haven't to keep your portfolio balanced. The dangers of emotional investing. Emotional reactions can lead to poor investment decisions. Common emotional traps include fear. During market downturns, fear can drive investors to sell their investments at a loss, missing out on the recovery. Greed. In booming markets, greed can lead to overconfidence and risky investments, potentially resulting in significant losses. Herd mentality. Following the crowd can lead to buying high and selling low, the opposite of a successful investment strategy. By recognizing and managing these emotions, you can make more rational decisions that align with your long-term goals. Developing a long-term mindset. Set clear goals. Define your financial goals and time horizon. Are you saving for retirement, a home, 
or your children's education. Clear goals will help you stay focused and committed. Create a plan. Develop an investment plan that outlines your strategy, asset allocation, and contribution schedule. Having a plan provides a roadmap and reduces the temptation to make impulsive decisions. Educate yourself. Continuously learn about investing to build confidence in your decisions. Understanding market principles and historical trends can help you maintain a long-term perspective. Seek professional advice. Consider working with a financial advisor who can provide guidance and keep you accountable for your investment strategy. The rewards of patience and discipline. By practicing patience and discipline, you can capitalize on the power of compounding, avoid costly mistakes, and achieve your financial goals. It's about trusting the process and staying committed to your plan, even when challenging. Patience and discipline are the bedrock of successful investing. They enable you to navigate market volatility, avoid emotional pitfalls, and stay on track toward your financial goals. By cultivating these virtues, you can build a solid foundation for long-term wealth and economic security. Next, we'll address the common pitfalls that new investors face and how to avoid them. By being aware of these pitfalls, you can avoid common mistakes and stay on the path to financial success. Chapter 7. Common Pitfalls and How to Avoid Them What mistakes do new investors often make, and how can you avoid them? Investing can be a rewarding journey, but it's not challenging. Understanding common pitfalls can help you avoid costly errors and stay on the path to financial success. Let's delve into these pitfalls and learn how to avoid them. 1. Chasing hot stocks. One of the most common mistakes new investors make is chasing hot stocks. When a stock is heavily hyped and its price soaring, jumping on the bandwagon is tempting. However, this approach often leads to buying high and selling low, which is the opposite of a successful strategy. Instead, focus on long term investments with solid fundamentals and avoid the temptation to follow short term trends. 2. Lack of diversification. Putting all your eggs in one basket can be risky. Many new investors make the mistake of investing heavily in a single stock or sector. Diversification spreads your risk across various assets, reducing the impact of any single investment's poor performance. Investing in a mix of stocks, bonds, and other assets can create a more stable and resilient portfolio. 3. Timing the market. Trying to predict market movements and time your trades can be costly. Market timing requires accurately forecasting both the high and low points of the market, which is extremely difficult. Instead, adopt a long-term investment approach and stay invested through market ups and downs. Consistency and patience often yield better results than attempting to time the market. 4. Overreacting to market volatility. Market volatility can be unsettling, especially for new investors. The instinct to sell during downturns to avoid losses can lead to missed opportunities when the market rebounds. Remember that short-term fluctuations are expected, and maintaining a long-term perspective can help you stay calm and avoid impulsive decisions. 5. Ignoring fees and expenses. As discussed in a previous chapter, fees can significantly erode investment returns. Many new investors overlook the impact of high fees and choose investments with high expense ratios or transaction costs. However, being mindful of fees and choosing low-cost investment options can enhance overall returns. 6. Lack of a clear plan. Investing without a clear plan is like sailing without a map. Many new investors fail to define their financial goals, risk tolerance, and investment strategy. A well-thought-out plan provides direction and helps you focus on your long-term objectives. Establishing and sticking to a plan can prevent you from making hasty, emotion-driven decisions. 7. Emotional investing Emotional investing is driven by fear, greed, or herd mentality. Fear can lead to panic selling during market downturns, while greed can result in chasing high-risk investments. Following the crowd without doing your research can also lead to poor decisions. Recognizing and managing these emotions is crucial for making rational investment choices. 8. Not rebalancing your portfolio. Over time, the performance of different assets will cause your portfolio to drift from its original allocation. Failing to rebalance your portfolio can result in taking on more risk than you intended. Regularly reviewing and adjusting your portfolio to maintain your desired asset allocation is essential for managing risk and ensuring alignment with your financial goals.
9. Neglecting to continue education. The investment world constantly evolves, and staying informed is critical to making sound decisions. Some new investors become complacent after making initial investments and neglect ongoing education. Continuously learning about market trends, investment strategies, and financial principles can help you stay ahead and make better investment choices. 10. Overcomplicating investments. Complex investment strategies might seem appealing but can lead to confusion and mistakes. Many new investors overcomplicate their portfolios with too many investments or sophisticated instruments. Simplicity often leads to better outcomes. Stick to straightforward, proven strategies like index investing and maintain a manageable portfolio. Avoiding these common pitfalls can significantly enhance your investment journey. By focusing on diversification, maintaining a long-term perspective, managing fees, and continuously educating yourself, you can steer clear of costly mistakes and stay on the path to financial success. Having identified the pitfalls, let's examine how to track progress and make necessary adjustments. In the next chapter, we'll discuss the importance of monitoring your investments and how to ensure they stay aligned with your financial goals. Chapter 8. The Rewards of Patience and Discipline What benefits can you expect from exercising patience and discipline in your investing journey? Patience and discipline are not just theoretical ideals they yield tangible rewards that can significantly enhance your financial future. Let's explore how these qualities translate into real-world gains and how to leverage them to achieve your investment goals. 1. Enhanced Long-Term Returns The stock market is known for its volatility in the short term, but it has historically trended upwards over the long term. Investors who maintain patience and discipline are better positioned to benefit from this long-term growth. You can capture the market's overall positive trajectory by staying invested through market ups and downs. This approach helps you avoid the pitfalls of market timing and allows the power of compounding to work its magic. 2. Reduce stress and anxiety. Frequent trading and attempting to time the market can be stressful and emotionally draining. Patience and discipline help you maintain a long-term perspective, reducing the anxiety associated with short-term market fluctuations. This steadiness allows you to make more rational decisions, focusing on your financial goals rather than reacting to temporary market noise. 3. Lower transaction costs. Frequent trading incurs higher transaction costs, including brokerage fees and taxes, which can erode your returns. By adopting a patient and disciplined approach, you minimize these costs. This means more of your money remains invested and compounded over time, enhancing your overall returns. 4. Better decision making. Emotion driven decisions often lead to buying high and selling low, significantly harming your investment performance. Patience and discipline foster a rational mindset, enabling you to make decisions based on sound financial principles rather than emotions. This improves your chances of achieving consistent and favorable outcomes. 5. The Power of Compounding As we discussed in the chapter on compounding, reinvesting your earnings allows your investments to grow exponentially over time. Patience and discipline ensure that you stay the course, giving your investments the time they need to compound effectively. The longer you remain invested, the more pronounced the compounding effect becomes, leading to substantial wealth accumulation. 6. Alignment with financial goals. Patience and discipline help you stay focused on your long-term financial goals. By adhering to your investment plan and avoiding short-term distractions, you can ensure that your investments align with your objectives. This alignment increases the likelihood of achieving your financial aspirations, whether saving for retirement, buying a home, or funding your children's education. 7. Learning and Growth Investing is a journey of continuous learning. Patience and discipline encourage you to educate yourself and refine your investment strategy over time. This ongoing learning process helps you become a more informed and confident investor, capable of making better decisions and adapting to changing market conditions. 8. Building Wealth Gradually Wealth building is not an overnight process. It requires consistent effort and time. Patience and discipline enable you to build wealth gradually, avoiding the temptations of get-rich-quick schemes and speculative investments. This steady approach ensures that your wealth is built on a solid foundation, making it more sustainable in the long run. Real-life example The Story of Warren Buffett Mr. Buffett, 
one of the most successful investors of all time, is a prime example of the rewards of patience and discipline. Buffett's investment philosophy revolves around buying high-quality companies and holding them long-term. His disciplined approach has led to remarkable returns over decades, illustrating the power of patience and long-term thinking. The rewards of patience and discipline in investing are numerous and profound. You can achieve substantial long-term returns and financial stability by staying the course, minimizing costs, making rational decisions, and leveraging the power of compounding. These virtues enhance your investment performance and create a more relaxed and confident investing experience. Next, we'll address how to track your progress and make necessary adjustments. Monitoring your investments is crucial for staying on course and ensuring they align with your financial goals. In the next chapter, we'll discuss the tools and strategies you can use to keep your investments on track. Chapter 9 Tracking Your Progress How do you know if your investment strategy is working? Tracking your progress is crucial for staying on course and ensuring that your investments align with your financial goals. By regularly monitoring your investments, you can make informed decisions and adjust your strategy as needed. Let's explore the tools and techniques you can use to keep your investments on track. Why tracking is important. Measure performance. Understand how well your investments perform compared to your expectations and benchmarks. Identify issues. Spot underperforming assets or areas where your strategy may need adjustment. Stay aligned with goals. Ensure that your investments continue to support your long-term financial objectives. Maintain discipline. Reinforce the habit of regular review and adjustment, which is crucial for long-term success. Tools for tracking your investments. Brokerage account dashboards. Most brokerage accounts offer dashboards that provide a comprehensive view of your portfolio. These dashboards typically show the current value of your investments, performance metrics, and historical data. Use these tools to review your portfolio's status and make informed decisions regularly. Personal finance software. Software like Quicken, Mint, or Personal Capital can help you track your investments alongside your other financial activities. These tools offer budget tracking, expense categorization, and investment performance analysis, giving you a holistic view of your finances. Spreadsheets Spreadsheets can be a powerful tool for those who prefer a more hands-on approach. You can create custom tracking systems tailored to your specific needs. Include columns for the investment type purchase price, current value, performance metrics, and relevant notes. Regularly update your spreadsheet to keep your data current. Mobile apps. Numerous mobile apps are designed to help you track your investments on the go. Apps like Robinhood, Fidelity, and E-Trade offer real-time updates, performance tracking, and market news, allowing you to stay informed wherever you are. Key metrics to monitor. Total return measures the overall performance of your investment including capital gains, dividends, and interest. It provides a comprehensive view of how much your investment has grown over a specific period. Annualized return shows your investment's average annual growth rate, which helps you compare the performance of different investments over varying periods. Benchmark comparison. Compare your investment performance against relevant benchmarks, such as the SP500 for stocks or a bond index for fixed income investments. This comparison helps you gauge whether your investments are performing as expected. Expense ratios and fees. Review the fees associated with your investments regularly. High fees can erode your returns, so invest in low-cost options that align with your strategy. Asset allocation. Make sure to review your asset allocation to ensure it aligns with your preferred investment mix. As the market fluctuates, your allocation may deviate from your original plan. Regularly rebalancing your portfolio can keep it in line with your risk tolerance and financial objectives, making adjustments. Rebalancing It involves adjusting your portfolio to maintain your target asset allocation. For example, suppose your stock investments have grown significantly and now represent a more significant portion of your portfolio than desired. In that case, you may need to sell some stocks and buy bonds to restore balance. Aim to rebalance at least once a year or whenever your allocation deviates significantly from your target. Addressing underperformance. If a particular investment consistently underperforms, evaluate whether it fits your strategy. Consider replacing it with an investment that better aligns with your goals and has a more robust performance history. 
Reviewing your goals. Your financial goals may change over time due to life events such as marriage, the birth of a child, or retirement. Regularly review and update your goals and adjust your investment strategy accordingly to ensure they continue to support your objectives. Regularly tracking your investments is a critical component of successful investing. By monitoring key metrics, using practical tools, and making necessary adjustments, you can ensure your investments stay aligned with your financial goals and continue to grow over time. Now that you can track your progress, let's explore the emotional aspects of investing and how to manage them. In the next chapter, we'll discuss how emotions can impact your investment decisions and strategies for staying rational and focused. Chapter 10. Managing Investment Emotions How do emotions affect your investment decisions? Emotional reactions can significantly impact investment performance, often leading to poor choices and financial losses. Understanding and managing your emotions is crucial for making rational, informed decisions that support your long-term financial goals. Let's explore how emotions influence your investments and strategies to stay sensible and focused. The Emotional Cycle of Investing Investing often triggers various emotions, from fear and anxiety to greed and excitement. These emotions can lead to impulsive decisions, such as panic selling during market downturns or chasing hot stocks during bull markets. The key to successful investing is recognizing and managing these emotional triggers effectively. Fear and Panic Market downturns can be frightening, leading to panic selling as investors try to avoid losses. This fear-based reaction can result in selling investments at a low point, missing out on potential recoveries. Understanding market fluctuations are normal and maintaining a long-term perspective can help mitigate fear, greed, and overconfidence. During market booms, greed can lead to overconfidence and risk-taking. Investors may chase high-flying stocks or invest heavily in speculative assets, expecting continued gains. This behavior can result in significant losses when the market corrects. Staying grounded and sticking to your investment plan is crucial to avoid the pitfalls of greed. Regret and FOMO fear of missing out. Regret over missed opportunities or losses can drive investors to make rash decisions. FOMO can lead to buying into trends at their peak, only to suffer losses when the market corrects. Recognizing that no investor can capture every opportunity helps maintain a balanced approach. Develop a solid plan. Having a well defined investment plan provides a roadmap for your financial journey. This plan should include your financial goals, risk tolerance, asset allocation, and investment strategy. A solid plan helps you stay focused and reduces the likelihood of emotional decision-making. Stick to your plan. Once you have a plan, stick to it. Market fluctuations and news can tempt you to deviate from your strategy, but maintaining discipline is critical. Regularly reviewing your plan and reminding yourself of your long-term goals can help you stay on course. Educate yourself. Knowledge is a powerful tool for managing emotions. Understanding market principles, historical trends, and investment fundamentals can provide confidence and reduce anxiety. Continuous learning helps you make informed decisions and avoid reacting impulsively to market events. Limit exposure to market news. Constant exposure to market news and predictions can fuel anxiety and lead to hasty decisions. While staying informed is important, limit your consumption of financial news to avoid becoming overwhelmed. Focus on long-term trends and fundamentals rather than daily market movements. Practice mindfulness and stress management. Techniques such as mindfulness, meditation, and stress management can help you stay calm and centered. Managing stress and maintaining a balanced mindset can improve decision-making and reduce emotional reactions. Seek professional advice. Working with a financial advisor can provide an objective perspective and help you focus on your goals. An advisor can offer guidance, answer questions, and reassurance during volatile markets. This support can help you manage emotions and make rational decisions. Emotional resilience in investing. Building emotional resilience is critical to long-term investment success. This involves developing the ability to stay calm and rational in market volatility and uncertainty. By cultivating patience, discipline, and a long-term perspective, you can more effectively navigate the emotional challenges of investing. Emotions are inherent in investing, but managing them is crucial for making sound decisions and achieving your financial goals. By developing a solid plan, 
sticking to it, educating yourself, and practicing stress management techniques, you can reduce the impact of emotions on your investment decisions. Understanding your emotions is vital, but setting realistic expectations is equally important. In the next chapter, we'll explore how to set achievable investment goals and maintain a balanced perspective on your financial journey. Chapter 11. Setting Realistic Expectations What should you realistically expect from your investments? Setting achievable goals and maintaining a balanced perspective is crucial for a positive investment experience. Unrealistic expectations can lead to disappointment, rash decisions, and financial losses. Let's explore how to set realistic expectations and stay grounded in your investment journey. Understanding Historical Market Performance It is essential for setting realistic expectations. While past performance does not indicate future results, it provides valuable insights into what one might expect over the long term. Stock Market Returns Historically, the stock market has provided average annual returns of around 7-10% to over the long term. However, these returns are not guaranteed and can vary widely from year to year. Some years may see significant gains, while others may experience losses. Understanding this variability helps set realistic expectations for your investments. Bond market returns Bonds are generally less volatile than stocks and provide lower but more stable returns. Historically, bonds have returned around 3-5% to annually. Including bonds in your portfolio can provide stability and reduce overall risk but it also means accepting lower returns than stocks. Setting your financial goals. Your financial goals should be specific, measurable, achievable, relevant, and time-bound smart. Setting clear goals helps you stay focused and motivated. Define your goals. Determine what you want to achieve with your investments. Are you saving for retirement, buying a home, funding your children's education, or building an emergency fund? Each goal may have different time horizons and risk tolerances. Quantify your goals. Once you've defined your goals, quantify them. For example, estimate how much you'll need to maintain your desired lifestyle if you save for retirement. Use online calculators or consult a financial advisor to help determine these amounts. Set a time frame. Establish a timeline for each goal. When do you need the money? Short-term goals 1 to 5 years might require a more conservative approach, while long-term goals 10 years can tolerate more risk. Aligning expectations with your strategy. Your investment strategy should align with your financial goals and risk tolerance. Here's how to ensure your expectations match your strategy. Risk tolerance. Assess your risk tolerance honestly. How comfortable are you with market fluctuations? A higher risk tolerance allows for a more aggressive investment strategy while a lower risk tolerance necessitates a more conservative approach. Investment Mix Choose an asset allocation that aligns with your goals and risk tolerance. A diversified portfolio of stocks, bonds, and other assets can help balance risk and return. Regular Reviews Review and adjust your portfolio regularly to stay aligned with your goals. Life changes, market conditions, and evolving financial objectives may require adjustments to your strategy. Managing expectations during market volatility. Market volatility is a normal part of investing. Managing your expectations during these periods is crucial for maintaining a long term perspective. Expect fluctuations. Understand that market ups and downs are regular. Expect periods of volatility and prepare mentally for them. Remember that short term fluctuations do not determine long term success. Focus on the long term. Keep your long-term goals in mind. While short-term losses can be unsettling, focusing on your long-term objectives helps you stay calm and avoid impulsive decisions. Stay disciplined. Stick to your investment plan, even during turbulent times. Avoid making decisions based on short-term market movements and remain committed to your long-term strategy. The Role of Patience and Discipline As discussed in previous chapters, patience and discipline are vital for setting and maintaining realistic expectations. They help you navigate market volatility, avoid emotional decisions, and focus on long-term goals. Investing in the world by setting realistic expectations is a cornerstone of successful investing. By understanding historical market performance, defining clear financial goals, aligning your strategy with your risk tolerance, and managing your expectations during market volatility, 
you can achieve a more positive and rewarding investment experience. With realistic expectations set, let's examine how to stay informed and continue learning. The next chapter will discuss the importance of ongoing education and staying up to date with the ever-changing investing world. Chapter 12. Staying Informed and Continuing Education How do you stay up to date with the ever-changing world of investing? Continuous learning is essential for making sound investment decisions and adapting to market developments. The investment landscape is dynamic, with new trends, strategies, and information emerging regularly. Let's explore how to stay informed and continue your education to enhance your investment journey. The Importance of Ongoing Education Investing is not a one-time task but a lifelong journey. Ongoing education helps you make informed decisions. Understanding the latest trends and strategies enables you to make better investment choices. Adapt to changes. The market and economic environment are constantly evolving. Staying informed allows you to adjust your strategy as needed. Build confidence. Knowledge builds confidence, reducing the likelihood of emotional reactions to market fluctuations. Enhance returns. Continuously improving your investment knowledge can lead to better returns and financial outcomes. Sources of investment education. Books are an invaluable treasure trove of profound knowledge. Among the must-read investment classics are Benjamin Graham's The Intelligent Investor Philip Fisher's Common Stocks and Uncommon Profits in Burton G. Malkiel Zahar Random Walk Down Wall Street These literary gems offer timeless wisdom and lay down the fundamental principles of investing. Online Courses and Webinars Many platforms offer online courses and webinars on various investment topics. Coursera, Udemy, and Khan Academy provide courses on financial markets investment strategies, and personal finance. Webinars from financial institutions and investment firms can also offer insights into current market conditions and strategies. Financial news and publications. Staying updated with financial news helps you understand market trends and economic developments. Reputable sources include the Wall Street Journal, Financial Times, Bloomberg, and CNBC. Regularly reading these publications can give you a broader perspective on the financial world podcasts and YouTube channels, offer accessible and engaging ways to learn about investing. Popular investment podcasts include The Motley Fool, Invest Like the Best, and Bigger Pockets. YouTube channels like Graham Stephan, Andre Jick, and CNBC Television provide valuable insights and analysis. Professional organizations and forums. Joining professional organizations and forums can connect you with other investors and industry professionals. Groups like the American Association of Individual Investors and forums like Reddit's R Investing provide opportunities for networking, learning, and sharing experiences. Developing a learning routine. Dedicate regular time to your investment education. Consistent learning keeps you informed and engaged for an hour a week or a few minutes daily. Diverse sources. Use a variety of sources to get a well-rounded perspective. Different mediums, such as books, articles, videos, and discussions, can provide unique insights and keep your learning experience diverse and exciting. Stay curious. Cultivate a curious mindset. Always look for new information, ask questions, and seek to understand the why behind investment strategies and market movements. Apply what you learn. Knowledge is most valuable when applied. Implement the insights and strategies you learn into your investment plan. Experimenting with small amounts of money can help you understand different approaches without significant risk. The Role of Professional Advice While self-education is crucial, seeking professional advice can complement your learning. Financial advisors, planners, and investment professionals can provide personalized guidance, help you navigate complex situations, and offer insights based on years of experience. Continuous Improvement the goal of continuous education is to improve gradually over time. Investing is a skill that develops with practice and learning. By staying informed and continuously improving your knowledge, you can make better decisions, adapt to changes, and achieve your financial goals more effectively. Staying informed and continuing your education are critical components of successful investing. By leveraging diverse educational resources, setting a regular learning routine, and seeking professional advice, you can stay ahead in investing and make informed decisions that enhance your financial future. As you continue learning, 
it's time to think about how your investments fit into your overall financial plan. The next chapter will discuss integrating your investment strategy with your broader financial goals to create a cohesive and effective financial plan. Chapter 13. Integrating Investments into Your Financial Plan How do your investments align with your broader financial goals? Integrating your investment strategy into your financial plan is essential for long-term economic stability and success. Let's explore creating a cohesive financial plan that includes your investment strategy and supports your broader financial objectives. The Role of a Financial Plan A comprehensive financial plan serves as a roadmap for your financial future. It helps you define and prioritize goals, clarify what you want to achieve financially in the short and long term, allocate resources efficiently, Ensure your money is working towards your goals in the most effective way. Manage risk. Identify and mitigate potential financial risks. Measure progress. Track your financial progress and make adjustments as needed. Budgeting and cash flow management. A solid budget is the foundation of any financial plan. It helps you understand your income, expenses, and savings potential. By tracking your cash flow, you can identify areas where you can save more and allocate those savings toward your investment goals. Debt Management Managing debt is crucial for financial health. High-interest debt, such as credit card balances, can erode your wealth. Prioritize paying off high-interest debt while maintaining manageable levels of good debt, like mortgages or student loans. Reducing debt frees up more resources for investing. Emergency Fund an emergency fund provides a financial cushion for unexpected expenses. Aim to save three to six months living expenses in a readily accessible account. This fund ensures you don't have to liquidate investments during a financial emergency, allowing your investments to grow uninterrupted. Insurance planning. Insurance protects against significant financial losses due to unforeseen events. Ensure you have adequate coverage for health, life, disability, and property. Insurance planning helps safeguard your financial future and ensures your investment strategy can continue without significant disruptions. Retirement planning. It involves setting goals for your post-work years and determining the savings needed. Contribute regularly to retirement accounts such as 401ks IRS or Roth IRAs. Utilize employer matches and tax advantage accounts to maximize your retirement savings. Align investments with goals. Different financial goals may require different investment strategies. Short-term goals, like saving for a home down payment, might benefit from conservative investments. Long-term goals, like retirement, can tolerate more risk and benefit from growth-oriented investments. Asset Allocation Determine an appropriate asset allocation based on your risk tolerance, time horizon, and financial goals. A diversified mix of stocks, bonds, and other assets can balance risk and return, helping you achieve your objectives. Regular contributions. Consistent contributions are vital to building wealth over time. Automate your savings and investment contributions to ensure you regularly add to your portfolio. Dollar cost averaging, where you invest a fixed amount at regular intervals, can reduce the impact of market volatility. Periodic review and rebalancing. Regularly review your financial plan and investment portfolio. Life events market conditions, and changing goals may require adjustments. Rebalancing your portfolio ensures it stays aligned with your desired asset allocation and risk tolerance. Utilizing tax strategies. Taxes can significantly impact your investment returns. Implement tax-efficient strategies to maximize your wealth. Tax-advantaged accounts. Contribute to tax-advantaged accounts like 401ks, IRAs, and HSAs. These accounts offer tax benefits that can enhance your savings. Tax Loss Harvesting Offset capital gains with capital losses through tax loss harvesting. This strategy involves selling underperforming investments to realize losses that can reduce your taxable income. Long-term capital gains Investors who hold onto their investments for over a year may be eligible for reduced tax rates on their long-term capital gains. This approach not only encourages patience but also promotes a long-term investment mindset. Working with a financial advisor A financial advisor can help you integrate your investments into a comprehensive financial plan. Advisors provide personalized guidance, help you navigate complex financial situations, and keep you accountable for your goals. 
integrating your investments into your financial plan ensures a cohesive and practical approach to achieving your financial goals. By aligning your investment strategy with your broader financial objectives, managing risk, and utilizing tax-efficient strategies, you can build a solid foundation for long-term economic success. With a comprehensive financial plan, let's prepare for different life stages and changes. In the next chapter, we'll discuss strategies for adapting your financial plan to meet the evolving needs of different life stages. Chapter 14. Preparing for Life Stages and Changes Are you ready for the financial changes that come with different life stages? Life is dynamic, and your financial plan must adapt to various milestones and changes. Whether starting your career, raising a family, or planning for retirement, each stage brings unique economic challenges and opportunities. Let's explore strategies for adapting your financial plan to meet the evolving needs of different life stages. Establishing Good Financial Habits The early years of your career are crucial for establishing good financial habits. Create a budget to track your income and expenses, prioritize saving and investing, and start building an emergency fund to cover unexpected expenses. Paying off debt Focus on paying off high-interest debt, such as credit cards and personal loans. Reducing debt early on frees up more savings and investing resources. Starting to invest Begin investing as soon as possible to take advantage of the power of compounding. Contribute to employer-sponsored retirement plans, such as a 401k, mainly if an employer match exists. Consider opening an IRA for additional retirement savings. Increasing contributions As your income grows, increase your contributions to retirement accounts and other investments. Aim to max out your retirement accounts and consider additional investment vehicles, such as taxable brokerage accounts. Balancing family finances Mid-career often involves family responsibilities like raising children and buying a home. Plan for these expenses by saving for your children's education through accounts like 529 plans and managing mortgage payments responsibly. Insurance and risk management Ensure you have adequate insurance coverage to protect your family and assets. Life, health, disability, and property insurance are essential components of a comprehensive financial plan. Catch-up contributions if you're 50 or older, take advantage of catch-up contributions to retirement accounts. These additional contributions can significantly boost your retirement savings. Diversifying investments Review your asset allocation to ensure it's aligned with your retirement timeline and risk tolerance. As retirement approaches, consider shifting to a more conservative investment mix to protect against market volatility. Planning for healthcare Healthcare costs can be a significant expense in retirement. Consider long term care insurance and explore options for covering healthcare costs, such as health savings accounts, HSAs, and Medicare. Creating a withdrawal strategy. Develop a strategy for withdrawing funds from your retirement accounts. Consider the tax implications of withdrawals and aim to create a sustainable income stream throughout retirement. Budgeting in retirement. Monitor your spending and adjust your budget as needed. Ensure that your expenses align with your retirement income and be prepared to make adjustments if necessary. Staying invested Even in retirement, it's important to stay invested to keep up with inflation and ensure your money continues to grow. Maintain a diversified portfolio that balances growth and income. Career changes Review and adjust your financial plan if you experience a career change, such as a job loss or a new job opportunity. Ensure your savings and investments align with your new income and goals. Marriage and divorce It can significantly impact your financial situation. If you get married, combine finances, update beneficiaries, and review your budget and goals. In the case of divorce, work with a financial advisor to divide assets and create a new economic plan. Inheritance and windfalls Receiving an inheritance or financial windfall can be a blessing but requires careful planning. Consider working with a financial advisor to manage the funds effectively, pay off debts, and invest for the future. Creating a will Ensure you have a valid will that outlines how your assets should be distributed after your death. Update your will as your circumstances change. Establishing trusts Trusts can help manage your assets and provide for your family according to your wishes. Consider setting up trusts for specific purposes, such as education or charitable giving. 
designating beneficiaries. Please review and update beneficiary designations on retirement accounts, insurance policies, and other financial accounts to ensure they reflect your current wishes. Preparing for different life stages and changes is essential for a comprehensive and effective financial plan. You can achieve economic stability and security by adapting your strategy to meet evolving needs. Stay proactive, review your plan regularly, and seek professional advice when needed to ensure your financial success. Finally, let's wrap up by discussing the legacy you want to leave and how your investments can support that vision. In the next chapter, we'll explore how to build a lasting legacy through thoughtful, low-cost investing. Chapter 15. Building a Lasting Legacy What legacy do you want to leave behind? Your investments can play a significant role in shaping your legacy, impacting not only your family but also your community and future generations. Thoughtful, low-cost investing can help you build a lasting legacy that reflects your values and aspirations. Let's explore how to plan for the future, support causes you care about, and ensure your financial success benefits those you leave behind. Personal Legacy Your legacy is your impact on your loved ones and close family. It includes financial security for your family, educational opportunities for your children, and support for significant life events such as weddings and home purchases. Philanthropic Legacy A philanthropic legacy involves giving back to your community and supporting causes that are important to you. This can include charitable donations, establishing scholarships, or funding community projects. Values-Based Legacy Your legacy can also reflect your values and principles. This might involve promoting sustainability through investments in green technologies or supporting social causes through impact investing. Estate Planning Estate planning is the process of arranging for the disposal of your estate. It ensures that your assets are distributed according to your wishes and can minimize taxes and legal complications for your heirs. Wills and Trusts Create a will to specify how your assets should be distributed. Consider establishing trusts to manage your assets and provide for your family's long-term needs. Beneficiary Designations Ensure all your financial accounts, insurance policies, and retirement plans have up-to-date beneficiary designations. Power of Attorney and Healthcare Directives Designate trusted individuals to make financial and medical decisions on your behalf if you cannot do so. Charitable giving can be fulfilling in supporting causes you care about and creating a lasting impact. There are various methods to incorporate charitable giving into your financial plan. Direct donations. Make direct contributions to charities and nonprofits that align with your values. Donor advised funds. DAFs allow you to donate assets to a fund and receive an immediate tax deduction. You can then recommend grants from the fund to your chosen charities over time. Charitable Trusts Charitable Remainder and Charitable Lead Trusts provide income to you or your beneficiaries while benefiting a charity. Impact Investing It involves investing in companies, organizations, and funds to generate social or environmental benefits alongside financial returns. By choosing investments that align with your values, you can support positive change while building wealth. Funding Education Investing in education can create a powerful legacy. Consider setting up education funds or scholarships for your children, grandchildren, or other deserving individuals. 529 college savings plans offer tax advantages and can help you save for educational expenses. Mentorship and knowledge sharing. Your knowledge and experience can be valuable assets to future generations. Mentoring young people, sharing your financial wisdom, and teaching investment principles can have a lasting impact. Family Legacy Planning Make sure to openly share your estate plan and wishes with your family. Talking about your goals, values, and the reasons for your decisions can help avoid any confusion or disagreements. Preparing the Next Generation Prepare your heirs to manage the wealth they will inherit. Provide financial education, involve them in family financial discussions, and gradually introduce them to investment principles and responsibilities. Sustainable Investing Environmental Social and Governance Investing ESG Investing focuses on companies that meet specific environmental, social, and governance criteria. Investing in ESG funds or companies can promote sustainable business practices and social responsibility. 
green investing. Green investing targets companies and projects contributing to environmental sustainability, such as renewable energy, energy efficiency, and conservation efforts. Supporting green initiatives through your investments can help protect the planet for future generations. Building a lasting legacy through thoughtful, low-cost investing requires careful planning and focusing on your long-term goals. You can create a positive impact beyond your lifetime by defining your legacy, incorporating charitable giving, educating the next generation, and aligning your investments with your values. Final Thoughts Thank you for embarking on this journey to understand common sense investing. By following the principles outlined in this book simplicity, patience, discipline, and a long-term focus you can achieve financial security and build a lasting legacy. Remember that the path to financial success is not a sprint but a marathon. Stay committed to your plan, continue learning, and make thoughtful decisions that reflect your values and goals. May your investments bring you lasting wealth, peace of mind, and a meaningful legacy. In this chapter, we've covered the essential elements of building a lasting legacy. This concludes our comprehensive guide on common sense investing and low-cost wealth building. Thank you for listening. Elevate your learning journey with our channel by subscribing today. Each video we create is designed to challenge, inspire, and enlighten. By subscribing, you ensure you're up to date with the latest content and support our quest to make learning accessible and engaging. Your feedback helps us tailor our content to serve you better. Join the conversation below, and let's learn and grow together. Let's explore the limits of what we can achieve together. Be well and thrive.